Hey everyone, it's Rise. This is Zato. Welcome back to Let's Play Tales of the Abyss. Well, today we're gonna head over to the Zhao Ruins and start some fights. Uh, the enemies did not change there. Except for the at final boss. first. But. Well, you'll see. For now, uh, if you didn't pick up the Iron Sand, obviously do that now because it should have reset now that you entered a town. But I got lucky and got it on my first try, so take that. Also, the Zao Ruins were blocked before, but for some reason, now they're not. So I don't know why. And they'll never be blocked again, by the way. So you have infinite access to them now. Why you'd ever want to go back here, I don't know. Of course the little chicken comes after me. We have no choice. Oh. That was Jade. Just Okay, Jade. If you want to. Oh, you can oh yeah, you can. Wait, Jade. You probably actually want all of your spells inactivated. Inactivate, activate it. Okay, Jade. If you wanna just <laughs> swing your weapon. I thought I had him set to only arts. That was weird. Well, check his attacks. Or I mean his setting. I've never seen him disobey me like that. Yeah, arts only. That's weird. Probably because when you told him to use that attack. Or had it locked. Uh, so he's like, oh, I don't know what I'm supposed to do. Maybe. Oh well, let's go in here. Okay, we're back at the Zao Ruins. And we're gonna meet you where we fought Largo and Sink. Well, by the save point right before them because this area is the same. But a couple things to keep in mind is you want to steal a gold dust from a lesser pan. Oh, lesser, yeah, from a lesser pan. And get a rock to drop from a lesser pan or an earth spirit. So yeah, those are the two things, two items you'll need for a side quest in addition to the iron sand from the search point. We're gonna do that off screen because it's pretty easy. Well, we're gonna see this cutscene, but. Oh god. There's not an ounce of concern in her body. <laughs> She's fine. I'm more worried about whether we can really trust what Ash told us. Are you saying he you don't? Hasn't exactly led us astray no. yet. Just that I'm concerned it may be a trap. You think they'd start trusting yes, the guy? It's certainly a possibility we can't dismiss. He did the tell them about Xerius. I'd suspect that the information is genuine. Though it's just as certain that Ash gave us that information to further his own ends. Right nice, now, Jade. let's focus on lowering the Outer Lands safely. Besides, yep. I can't imagine Ash is trying to destroy the Outer Lands. True. Things will only get worse the longer we wait. What are you waiting for? Let's go take care of this. <laughs> Annis might have the right idea. Yeah. So, yeah, we're gonna steal those. Steal that item off screen, get the drop off screen, and meet you where we fought Largo and Sink. Alright, so uh, we stole the uh, the rock, or we got the rock to drop from uh, an Earth Spirit, I believe. Yep. Or no, we got it to drop from a Lesser Pan, actually. No. And then we stole it from a, we stole a Gold Dust from a Lesser Pan. So, yeah. And of course we got the Iron Sand outside, so that'll be useful when we go return to Sheridan, but for now, uh, th this is the party I have for a reason. And, yeah, you want three mages, plus a melee fighter, either Guy, Luke, oh, I know or Natalia, if you want, up. but, oh, I know what's coming up, so, yeah, it's finally here, what, final battle with the sword dancer, no, dude, that's much later, <laughs> oh, but we're using a very similar strategy to the sword dancer, the bridge is shaking, Unfortunately, the third sword dancer the fight bridge. is not that this hard. This entire underground city is shaking. It's faint, but I can feel phonic arts being used. 
I don't That's feel bad. anything. Is it a trap? Or an enemy? Even if it is, we don't have a choice. We have to keep going. Let's be careful. My, I never would have expected you to say something like that. Shut oh, up. Oh yeah. We gotta go. I sure hope this bridge is still here when we come back. Don't, don't say jinx it, like guy. That. Well, if it's not, we can always live here. Nice city. How would we save the world then? Well, someone else can do it. Ash. Only one other person knows about it. He'll take care of it. Besides, he might give us a rope. And... Yes, a rope. What the hell? An earthquake? Whoa. <laughs> uh, that's really obnoxious. <laughs> Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Well, hit a button. Okay. Stop. There we go. Look out. Dodge. Here it comes. Is that a scorpion with a tail that has a dinosaur head on it? It has no head. That... Uh... Okay, this guy's pretty much exactly like the sword dancer in that he actually has arc, wide raking, wide arcing attack. So magic is the way to go. You know, you want uh, guy to or loot to distract him. Free run is not really going to help you that much. Uh, you're better off really guarding his attacks. And, uh, other than that, not really that strong. Yeah, if you need, uh, healing, Tyr will take care of it for you. Just keep going with, uh, negative gate, limited combo. He does have over limit. Just kind of avoid it. Got it. Yeah, I see he hit Amos even way, way back there. You need to. You have center. I don't think it's set. Up in circle. Oh boy. He has no element of weakness, I don't think. No, he doesn't have any element of weakness. He just, uh, he attacks fast, but he does move slowly, so... Yeah, he's center again. Oh, we got him. Yay, I almost died, but we got him. And he drops a resist ring, which... It resists. It gives you 10% elemental resistance for every element. Except for one. No, all six. There's seven. That's not considered an element according to the game's battle system. So, it's useful. You can equip it if you like. Uh, me, personally, I prefer the silver boots. But, you can equip it on somebody if you like. I told you, it's a scorpion with a dinosaur's head for a stinger! It may be a monster from the Dawn Age. I've seen it before in a book in Yulia City. But I didn't think they were supposed to be this aggressive. The Oracle's God Generals were here before. Perhaps they agitated it. True. They just have been guarding the ruins. I don't think so. Let's just pray nothing else like this comes jumping out at us. I agree wholeheartedly. Now, shall we be going? Exactly. Now we actually want to... Enter this building. Now we have new enemies. All of which... Oh, I suppose I should have... Looked them up. Well, I suppose I should have changed my party members, but that's okay. Camouflers! I don't know why Earth Spirits are there. Stone Ales! Nothing interesting about them at all. I wouldn't even pay any attention to the Earth Spirit. He'll just die as a result of being there. No elemental weakness or anything. Ooh, blessed drops! Oh, which I didn't let hit. 
That is a high level water spell for Jade. Pretty good, if I recall correctly. Well, no, it is pretty good. It's, yeah, it's quite powerful. Uh, doesn't have the stunning power that all those other high-level spells are, but still pretty strong. Does a lot of damage. Uh, Wind and Lightning Field of Phonons is a Divine Saber, which is really powerful and actually has this, has uh, some stunning capability to it. So overall, it's a good addition to his arsenal. Definitely be keeping that around. But yeah, I'm gonna go with... Let's go ahead and bring in Natalia. Yeah. That's good. I'll play as Natalia for a little while. Yeah. Tear is going to be getting a ton of showtime in a little bit, so. Alright, let's go. Oh. Eh, nothing that interesting. Wait, where's Gallant Barrage? Oh, there it is. Just take him out. Pretty simple. That Ether Slash is uh, pretty cool looking. Looks like a bow to me. It's because it is a... Wait, which way did I come from? Yeah, go the right way. Yeah, there we go. There is a, an enemy called a phantom in here that I'd <coughs> like to fight. Because he's actually somewhat interesting. I believe that's them. Piece of cake. Yeah, these guys are actually somewhat interesting. Challenging. Well, not challenging, but... Challenging. They are weak to fire. So uh, that's one thing. And they also have an annoying habit of remaining at 1 HP for a very long time. I don't know why. And uh, there's really nothing you can do about it other than keep attacking until they die. But because they're weak to fire, we are going to manually right, cast Flame go. Burst on them. <laughs> leave, uh, I can actually leave Jade to handle them with uh, Flame Burst and then concentrate on the other guys. I like how Jade gets like irritated that you have the ability to order him around. That ought to do it. And does Natalia actually have? Yeah, she's got flat edge. And it. Hey Jade, you wanna do that one more time? Obviously, any fire field that's going on will work pretty well as well. As well. <laughs> But yeah, they're actually somewhat interesting because they actually have an element of weakness. But yeah, now we got a pineapple gel. Uh, actually, I do want to equip the the uh, elemental ring, the resist ring on Natalia for now, just because she could use the uh, elemental protection since she's at range and uh, she's well a primary healer. Okay, let's keep moving. Okay, let's keep moving. Head into this room. Should be a couple of chests in here. Wow! This place is huge! Yeah, not really. What is it? Kind of a short area. I just can't believe we've been living on top of these things. Well, you did blow but one up, true. so not anymore. Anything that's not right in front of them. But curiosity can at times reveal things that were better left unknown. Yeah, like the fact that the whole planet is just a liquid just poison. Just like with the outer lands. Nevertheless, we cannot run now that we have seen the truth. Because you know, somehow there's more surface area in the Let's sky go. than the on the ground. Wait for us. All right, all right, I'll let it go. I'll let it go. Not my fault that physics is- Okay, I'll, I'll stop. Do you want me to explain it to you again? Yes, explain it to me. Alright. Basically, you have a sphere. 
its biggest point is on the outside of the sphere. When you go in towards the center, it's smaller. So therefore, the sky is bigger than the center of the world. You say so, Ada. Scientific Okay, let's keep uh keep moving. Thank you, Doctor Doctor Ado. I'm not a doctor. Oh, a new enemy! Phonic Goyle. I don't think we're gonna be encountering any more phantoms, so just turn on spells. No. You got him, Anis. Yeah, I hope you like Anis killing all the enemies for you. Oh, don't worry, she'll be getting help in the very near future. Oh, well, I guess there is another phantom. Okay, apparently the uh, phantoms can inflict weak on you. Not that that's a big deal or anything. Yeah, two more chests there. Because we totally need the money. Actually, we kind of do. Alright, Anna's picked up a skit. No, no. She picked up a new spell. Her third spell. It is a it's our first high level spell. It's not elemental, which is a little weird, but it is a one hit spell that is absurdly powerful. Uh, with the genius wand, it's doing already over 5,000 damage, and uh, basically nothing keeps up with it for as far as raw base power is concerned. At least for magic, it's easily the strongest spell in the game. There are spells that are better than it because they have almost as much damage with better stunning, but Obviously, since it's only one hit, it doesn't stun very well, but when you're dealing that much damage, one do you really care? You. And it has a really powerful earth field of phonons called Rock Mountain, which basically does the same amount of damage, but over multiple hits, so it actually does stun. So, yeah, overall, it's a great spell, so, yeah, she'll be using that a lot. I think this is just a dead end over here. Well, there's an enemy, I guess. Keep moving. Yeah, just a dead end, that's what I thought. There is another chest in here, but it's not till the end. Okay, let's keep moving. Okay, so Guy picked up White Tiger Blade. White Tiger Strike. Uh, White Tiger Strike, yeah. It's Crescent Strike and Tiger Blade. It ends with Tiger Blade, though, so it does have that weird lag at the end of it. But it's just a basically an improved version of it. I don't know if you want it or not. Um, yeah, get rid of Demonic Tiger Blade. Yeah, it is better than Demonic Tiger Blade. So, yeah, overall it's good art, but no field of phonons, unfortunately. Still a useful addition. Not as good as Soaring Light Spear, but then again, that Soaring Light Spear is kind of cheating. Mm hmm. I know we're approaching the 20 minute mark, but we're so close to the end of the area that might as well finish it. Plus, we're going to have to backtrack out of here. I don't know what the point of that save point is. It's for the boss fight. There is no boss fight. We already fought it. Oh, my God. Can't believe we forgot about the boss fight. There is no boss fight. <laughs> there is only Zool. Who's a boss? That was a Ghostbusters joke. Yeah, but Zula was a boss. Yeah, and the NES Ghostbusters. Still a boss. Actually, no, it was Gozer. He never fought Zula. Then you got the congratulations at the end. Oh, good. This one responded to me, too. Did the Excellent. Commandant seal this one, too? So it appears, but... The Sephiroth are out of control? Well, we're screwed. We lose. Game over. I need to get rid of the red part, right? Nah, get rid of the blue part. Okay. No, don't do that! Question. Why don't you just do that for all of them? 
That does make a lot of sense. Oh, right. Inscribe an upward-facing arrow immediately above the light. Shall I take over? No. We're erasing the code through brute force, so we can't write using the normal controls. Ah! It would... Wait, that doesn't make any sense. We have to forcibly carve it in using Luke's hyper-resonance. Uh, I, I guess. Next, we'll enter the commands, but... You don't know ancient Espanian, do you? Of course not! <laughs> Why even ask that? Alright, do it using the phonic language we use now. It would've been funny, he's like, well, we're screwed then. Here's a book, study quickly, man. The grammar is almost the same. It should work. That would be like saying, well, Japanese and Chinese use symbols, so maybe it'll work. What do I write? Tree ascent, triple speed, hold. Got it. Looks Does like not went. compute. Initiating crash sequence. <laughs> Self-destruct intent. Next. Trace a line from the fourth Sephiroth to the third. Then write the same commands on the third Sephiroth. The third Sephiroth is Shuri Hill, right? I'll give yeah, it a it's the only other one you erased there. I mean, if they're all connected, he should just be able to do that for all of them. That is true. And we ran out of budget for the rest of this cutscene. Like begun to descend. Let's wait beside the passage ring until it finishes, just in case. You having fun rubbing your knees there, Luke? He's panting. Sure he is. He needs it a knee massage. The descent, and the passage ring seems normal. Phew. <laughs> it's almost boring that it all went so smoothly. Did you want it to go wrong? I wouldn't get too cocky about it if I were you. Yeah, you're probably right. Wow, you didn't even act insulted. I'm scared I might get overconfident and let something happen that I can't undo. Yeah, that would be bad. Tear, you don't have to look at me like that. I'm not going to have any more outbursts. No, that's not what it is. She's probably just tired. We spent more than a day on this. Well, she's just slowly dying. What the? Okay, hey, I didn't expect her to fall okay? down. <laughs> I I'm totally sorry. did not expect that. She's not slowly dying, she's dead! I can't even Pick her up, guy. Health. What a poor soldier. Worry about yourself more than your reputation as a soldier. Are you sure you're alright? Thanks. I'm fine. Then let's go outside. We should check to see if we've arrived in the cliff. Yeah, that'll probably be a good idea. When you think yeah. you're witnessing a problem, it's best to look for the cause. What? Oh. Yeah. Okay. Don't understand that at all. Alright. And here we get a wing bottle, which will let us not have to backtrack the whole way. So, um, unless there's a cutscene at some point in the middle of this, which I don't think there is, we're gonna backtrack out of here off screen. Uh, we'll just meet you at. Oh! Oh, we can use the wing bottle here. I thought we had to walk all the way back to the other save point. Well, that's convenient, so I guess we'll just stop here then. See, there was a reason for that save point. Shut up. You... Should have told me that was gonna happen. Okay, so this is Ryzen. This is Ado. Signing off. Take care.